Sean Sewell with Ingearment.com here in the mountains of Colorado. Just did some winter camping, getting ready to go do some split boarding. And got the little split board right there. Yeah. But I just want to share with you real quick what is my favorite base layers? What do I use most often? What about using the last two seasons? And what did I actually purchase with my hard earned money? It is the 0.6 uh, men's base layer long sleeve, as you see right here, the leggings as well as the boxers. So that's, uh, let's put my money where my mouth is. So let's get into it. First and foremost, we'll go over sizing. I am six foot one, 210, 45 inch chest, 33 inch waist, 36, 37 on the arms. This is a men's extra large on the top base layer. I actually went with a men's medium or a large on the bottom for my 33 by 32 inch waist. They both fit great. I went with the medium for the boxers. I'm not gonna do a video on the boxers anytime soon. That's like, I used to do that years ago. I'm not too old to get on YouTube my underwear. But I will share with you the base layers right here. It is a 240 weight. That is a midweight, not lightweight, not heavyweight. 240 weight um, merino, as you can see right here. Reason I chose to go with the 240 weight, this guy today, is because I was winter camping and I think it was negative 8 with 81% humidity last night. That is flipping cold. My fingers, even though they're in these, looks like gloves, are numb as heck. I should put my mittens back on. Yeah, I think I'm going to put my mittens back on for the rest of this uh, review here. Oh, mittens. So, let's talk about the stuff. Uh, point six, guys from Smartwall left and created point six, and as you can expect, it's very high quality. Uh, they, they use fantastic 18 or 18.9 micron merino. Uh, as you can tell from, I don't know how many <laughs> reviews on merino we do a month. I, <laughs> all we do is live in merino. Or yak wool sometimes, I do like yak wool, uh, but mostly it's merino. For a reason, it's just easy to maintain. Uh, I simply wash it um, with a powderized uh, sport suds, I think out of Canada, non-detergent kind of cleaner. Just wash it and I lay it on on a drying rack and I'm good to go. If I wash it, this is kind of embarrassing, the hoodie that I wear every day is a merino based hoodie and I have not washed it in two years. But it doesn't even stink because usually merino doesn't grab on to smells unless like you cake your under part under arms and deodorant and it gets clogged up in the fibers but um i don't do that uh so the garment itself won't stink you will stink but i like to use merino wool because i can use it for days on end like i did use it all day yesterday training in our facility in denver colorado then head up to the mountains in the flipping cold camped had some adult beverages slept in it and here we are getting ready to go split boarding in it but um, yeah, 0.6 makes great stuff. They don't have a huge product line, which I love. They have like a base layer, base layer of the zip, a t-shirt, a boxer, um, some gloves, I think a beanie, um, and then the leggings. And they all just work great. I like it because it's also not like uber Euro fit. A lot of base layers are just like, I feel like a sausage. And I'm not like overweight or anything, but it's just kind of, I don't like feeling like I'm the sheep's stomach casing on a sausage. I like feeling like I'm just a guy that needs to put on a shirt and a pair of pants and go out and do some stuff. As you can tell, the, the fit, it's nice. It's not too too tight, but it is on my skin and it's going to do a great job regulating my body temperature, letting the heat evaporate, and also providing that warmth to that 240 weight. All right, as you can tell, my jaw is getting frozen. My fingers are already frozen. I'm going to put my jackets back on and get my split boards right there up on the secret trail will not tell you where i am but it is in colorado and 0.6 is colorado based uh, i do have a coupon code i need to clear it with them before i put it up but if uh they do clear it and i think they will it's a substantial discount code <laughs> um and put it to use which is why i use that code and i got these so i supported the, the local team um aaron rose on our team Def split water on instagram uh is a big fan of 0 0.6 he's a official rider snowboarder for them so I'll tie it all together here in a moment. But uh, if you want to see more content like this, consider subscribing. We have a lot more content like this coming up. More interviews and reviews galore. As you know, if you're a subscriber to the channel, you know. Thank you for being a subscriber. If you're not a subscriber yet, what are you doing? 98% of the people who watch our videos are not subscribers. But yet we have 5 million views a year. So there's a lot of people coming here for information. And if they like it, hopefully it's helpful. Thumbs up is always appreciated, and then a, a subscribe is even more appreciated because they can stay up to date on more of these things. You know, just sit there Googling a review on this thing, and you probably know we're gonna do it for you. So, save you some time. I'm Sean Sewell, owner and director of Stoke for InGearment.com, and until next time, take care.